So after owning these Doc Martens, the 1461 and the 3989, these two Doc Martens are very similar. The biggest difference is um, this one is like wingtip and this one, I usually describe it as like the low cut version of the 1460 Doc Martens. I really like these shoes and these are just some of my thoughts that hopefully can help someone who is thinking about getting these or just to share my ideas basically after six months. Breaking into these Doc Martens were not as hard as other Doc Martens. The pain points on these Doc Martens are since it's low cut, it's around the ankle area, right around here. Right in this area is where I'm talking about. And for the first couple of times that you do wear it, you're going to feel this pain, but it goes away pretty fast. Another one is right along this heel area. The heel part is, it's pretty strong, but at the same time, with the heel, eventually it gets softer. But when it comes to the toe box or this frontal part, I really did not have too many issues with it. I don't have wide feet, but they were great on my feet. And I, within like a week, I break into them. And when it comes to the soles, they're pretty decent and they still look brand new. When it comes to these two shoes, I'll say the 1461s, I wear them more because they're black. And then with this one, since it's red, it's more like a specialty shoe, like if I want to show off or if I'm going to somewhere just a little bit more special. When it comes to comfort, after you break into them, they get very comfortable. Just like any other Doc Martens, they get comfortable after you break into them. And then also with the other Doc Martens that I do have, I never changed the size. I just stuck to the same size for each Doc Martens and they all fit the same. These shoes were made more for the summertime. I mean, I've never tried wearing it during the winter time. I don't think they are thick or durable enough or depending on where you live during the winter time, that's how the results varies. But for me, I like these shoes. They're very versatile, especially this one. I wear it a lot and um, if you have any comments or questions, leave it down in the comments below and uh, share any ideas because other people want to know. Thanks for watching.